I'm gonna tell you why video games just don't feel the same anymore and a practical step you can take right now. If only we could go back to the good old days of 2018 Fortnite. Comment what was the best time you've ever had with a video game. My personal favorite was GTA 5 in 2014. It was the start of 2021 and me and my friends would hop on Discord as soon as we woke up and binge play Minecraft and Valorant. We played for around two months but we eventually got bored of playing the same games every day. Imagine if I put that time into making a business. I didn't even like playing video games anymore. There was nothing good to play. I wanted a new game to play that was fun like 2018 Fortnite. Fortnite. This was my sign to move on from video games. So what did I do? Instead of actually doing something productive with the free time I had from not playing video games, I installed a new game, Assassin's Creed Valhalla. I was getting excited again to play. I liked the idea of playing a new campaign game, but in reality, I didn't even want to. So I forced myself to binge play the game. And this happened with tons of games, Call of Duty, The Last of Us. I forced myself to binge play games instead of actually doing something productive because it was easier. I wanted that sense of achievement, progress, and reward rewards but could only get it in video games not in real life the majority of people end up in this position but don't know what to do they go find other games to play but they will never be as good as they think this is a sign to expand as a person you like video games because of the progress achievement and rewards you get but you can get that in real life too imagine if you put in the hours you play video games into making a business would you rather level up in video games or in real life but society doesn't want you to do that for the huge businesses to thrive they need everyone to be addicted video game companies and Netflix Netflix shows know exactly what to do to keep you addicted and re-watching and keep playing. Video games give you exactly what you lack in real life. You lack friends, video games have you covered. You lack rewards, you lack intimacy, video games have you covered. So it's not your fault that you're addicted and still play, but it definitely is your responsibility. I grew up with video games. I loved video games. I still occasionally get the urge to play, but I know that it's not really that enjoyable. I get nostalgic about a game and think about how much fun it would be to play, how good the vibes would be, but in reality, it's not even that fun anymore. The last two months before I quit playing video games, I was forcing myself to play. I didn't want to quit something that brought me so much joy in the past. But when you let go is when you grow. As corny as it sounds, I'm literally playing the game of life, improving strength in the gym, discipline, and money, and I've never been happier. Imagine if you use the time you spend playing video games into making a business or actually doing something productive with your time that helps your future self. Are you going to look back at yourself with regret for spending a thousand hours on Valorant instead of on a business or on your goal? goals. By the way, join the Discord server. We're a community of five robots and two actual people. So join and we can be friends. I'll even write you a letter. And always remember to trust the process.